Hey guys, so welcome to my channel. This is the part 3 of building an adventure game using Google's Game Builder. Okay, I think I have to decrease the range. Alright, so previously, uh, let me see. Okay, let, me, let me fix something. Um, the range is very high. Velocity offset. Where is the range by the way? Search range star 50. Okay, let's give it um, 30. Right. Um, and where's my where's my weapon? Or first thing I want to add scoreboard. Um, so this is what I'm going to do. So I'm going to click on the the enemy robot, and when they die, they're going to broadcast a message. So when they die here, right, and they're going to broadcast a message to me. And the message is going to be enemy dead. Right, and that's the name. Make sure you copy copy this name. It has to be exactly the same. Then I'm gonna pick uh, the fox. All right, so here's the fox. So I'm going to add another if and else, saying, um, saying, when I receive the message, a receive message. The name of the message is enemy dead. Then I'm going to score point. So this automatically does adds one point to the scoreboard. Um, it keeps track of score. And also I'm going to add the scoreboard on the screen. This is pretty much it. You don't have to do anything else. Now every time I destroy one of these enemy robots, uh, it's going to give me point uh, one. Uh, that's one thing. Okay. So that only when my health is less than ten. Um, I'm going to uh, grab apples, otherwise I'm not. Okay. So I'm going to click on Apple, get edit original. So what happens is that um, collision, when I collide with the apple, uh, I'm going to do like variable check. This variable is, so I'm going to whose variable is going to be event causer and variable name, I think it's health or lowercase. Um, and if it's less than 10, then I'll be able to grab it, okay? Um, okay, so this two has to be true, then this will happen. So my score is zero right now. See, if you, if you see the bottom left left corner, it's a score, right? So I'm player one, uh, score is zero. The zero is the score. So if I kill one, I should be able to, zero will become one, so it's like one score. There you go, see my score is one now. Alright, so that works. Now let's see, my my health is seven, see if I can collect apple. Uh, this is a good place. So one, two, I should be able to collect only when my health is less than ten. So I shouldn't be able to collect more any more apple. There you go, see that? I can't. I can't collect any more apples. So that logic works too. The score works and the collecting apple works. Alright, so I'm gonna make you spawn somewhere safe. So you spawn spawn here. So maybe we can set a logic in the player. If and else. So we can say uh, when the actor count of um, actor tag enemy, I don't know if this is gonna work though, but I just want to try. If enemy is, let's try um, equal to like some high number, like 21, so that we can test it right away. Uh, when that happens, um, we can we're gonna show a message just just for the test uh, testing purpose, right? Uh, this the first thing probably we want to do is uh, we can click edit original we can click on the enemy and then go to edit right and then we want to tag tags constant this is the tags is wrong it's going to be robot the tag is robot um, all right so I'm going to save this right so now what I'm going to do now the tag is right now we're going to go to fox 
good logic. Uh, we're going to say um, if we're gonna now the tag is going to show up. So this this is the right tag. Right count went to this less than let's do 21 for test, sake of testing. Then it's going to show this message. There you go, it worked. Okay, so this is what I'm thinking. Um, now I'm going to change the logic to say uh, if it's equal to zero. If the all the enemies are dead, zero, then I'm gonna see. I'm gonna show the win message. You win end game. Uh, win everyone wins, and then I'm going to reset the game. Um, reset the game. I'm going to spawn. Spawn to return to spawn point, which is the actor to the original spawn point. All right, there you go. All right, so let's give it a try. Uh, what else we're we gonna do? We could do more stuff. Uh, we can add teleporter, for example. Uh, we can add a teleporter here. A teleporter. Teleport. Uh, teleport myself, uh, the event closer. Uh, teleport to. Uh, te this is pretty cool. So I'm gonna make another copy. This will teleport to. Okay, so I'm gonna copy this. And then move this. So we'll be able to teleport from one place to another. Right here. Teleporter Porter One Breaking Teleporter Two. So you have to break link and then so now I have two copies of the same site teleporter one teleporter two. So in this logic I can say uh, if collides collision happens uh, with uh, the player teleporter two. So I'm going to do the same thing here. Uh, if collision happens with the director, uh, then event causer then is going to send to teleport one. There you go. And let's begin. It's very, very exciting. Let's see how this works. <coughs> Nothing happens. Oh, there you go. See, it works, but it, it can work straight away. There you go. See that? Oh, we do the teleporter works. Uh, now let's see if the uh, let's play the actor again. Okay. All right. So we have our health is ten. We kill zero. Let's grab a weapon. So I'm gonna finish this side. Thank <laughs> you. 
right, so we finished this side and there's nothing on that side I think, I believe. Where did this guy came from? That was accidentally. Alright, so I'm gonna use the teleporter to go to the other side. Wait, what happened? What? What? So you might want to try different, different, different object. Uh, I'm gonna make it bigger so that it doesn't screw me up. Uh, let's try again. Alright, so there you go. Now it worked. And I came back in. Alright, there you go. So the teleporter works, but you know it has to be a better object. Did I clear up this this area? No, I So now we can go to which area is not clear. Over there. Now what you're looking for is the the winning screen, right? And uh, putting us back to the uh, starting point. It's gonna also gonna reset the game. There you go. You won. Resetting game in three, two, one. There you go. And we are back to the starting point and the game reset. The score is zero. All the enemies are back. All the sporting point and everything is back. Alright. I hope you guys found it useful. If you're new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. And don't forget to press the thumbs up button. Until next time, goodbye.